Hello, so it is bright and early and I am just getting ready to shoot a fashion video. Um, I'm going to go to my dad's house and shoot it because he has like the nice landscape and everything. It would be really awkward to shoot it in my apartment complex and everyone would be like, okay, that girl's crazy. But by the way, I'm going to make some coffee really fast, I think. So yeah, but by the way, I wanted to tell you guys... If you guys know anything about Greek yogurt, tell me more about it because I had one of my Greek yogurts that I've showed you guys. I had the raspberry one. There's still the peach one left, but it is literally the same as regular yogurt. Like, what is the difference between yogurt and Greek yogurt? Like, I want to know because I was so disappointed. I was expecting it to be a lot better than it was, and it literally just tasted like regular yogurt the consistency was a little bit um better better it was a little thicker which i kind of liked but besides that it tasted like regular yogurt so i don't know what the deal is with um greek yogurt these days and what people are talking about how it's delicious but <laughs> tastes like regular yogurt to me i don't know maybe i didn't get the right kind i am not really sure but if you guys know anything about greek yogurt then comment down below and like suggest another brand for me to try maybe something like not too expensive obviously but all right i'm just making coffee making coffee decaf y'all i do two scoops of these suckers bam And turn that sucker on. So I'm having like a mini anxiety attack because someone commented on my main channel that biotin, if you guys watched my tips on how to grow hair fast or whatever, my recent video on my main channel, I showed biotin and someone commented saying biotin is known to cause cystic acne. So I've been taking it for about a month now and I'm breaking out like you guys can probably tell well maybe not but I'm breaking out like all around my hair like um t-zone which is normally where I break out anyway but I'm like what is this this is usually a little bit more than normal so if I keep breaking out like this I'm probably gonna stop taking biotin I don't know if you guys have heard that myth or whatever then let me know if it's actually supposed to cause acne because I'm kind of freaking out because my skin is pretty good for the most part, but I'm gonna get ready to go. I got my nice camera. This is gonna be the first fashion video that I, technical fashion video, that I shoot on my new camera. So this is all the stuff I have to bring. So super excited. Um, yeah, gonna get going soon, but I will catch you guys later. By the way, here is my outfit of the day really quick. I actually took someone's advice in the comments and this is actually my black maxi dress but I just tucked in the top part and turned it into like a maxi skirt so I mean I think it kind of looks good I wasn't sure what top to pair it with so I just decided to go for like a flowy this flowy cheetah top which I think kind of goes with it okay so yeah it's my outfit and okay now I'm gonna go hello everyone we're at Melissa's dad's house and she's over there getting her laundry that she forgot. There she is. Hello. <laughs> We're going to Mickey D's and, and in out, out and grocery shopping. Grocery shopping, you know, the huge. It's the life of a chunk and a diva. It is. Got it. Oh. Okay, bye. You know where we're at. You know. Mickey D's, y'all. In a little pan over. And all of a sudden, there she is. <laughs> um, we're at Mickey D's. Again. And I'm eating a fry. The saddest moment of my day at Mc McDonald's is when the fries are all gone. <laughs> and this is the finished product. And this is the finished result. <laughs> and we went to In N Out too, because so I got a. Um, what is it called? A. Grilled cheese. Grilled cheese animal style, which, by the way, I recommend getting because I thought it was 
It looked pretty good. I'll show you a picture. This is what it looked like. Yes, I took a picture of it. Don't blame me. Hello, so we just went to the grocery store and we're gonna do a grocery store haul. So I got avocados because they are so cheap here. They were two for or no, um this whole bag for two fifty, which is pretty good. Even though you'd think we live in California and they'd be like one penny. But what? they're not. Because they? isn't it because they're grown in California? They are. Yeah. For Mexico, I don't know. And then I got two bags of chocolate chips, y'all. <laughs> and Juan got two bags too. Literally, we're such shucks. Because we're going to make... Cur curdled sour cream. <laughs> sour I should have got cream. avocados too. Oh, oh well. yeah. And then I got salt. And salt. And then... Bam. Two bags of chocolate chips. Because y'all know it's a necessity for us. So. It is. Yeah. So I just got home after a successful day of filming and eating, story of my life. I had to go to my dad's house to film some videos because the background's really good at his house, so, or the backyard is good for filming. And then I asked him to do some of my laundry, so he did a bunch of my laundry. And ooh, I think I got some mail. <gasps> yes, I finally got my Seventeen magazine, which I have been freaking waiting for for the longest time because all of our mail has to be forwarded to my um, apartment or from my dad's house to my apartment. So, yeah. And then also, ooh, I got a new pair of shoes today from Schumann. I'm so excited um, for this, the shoes that I got. And they're these really cute sandals. They have like beaded detailing on them. I don't know. They're just basic black sandals. I think they'll go so cute with a lot of different outfits. So I'm really excited for those. I'll probably show you guys those on how I style them in a video or something. So yeah, I am out of breath and yay for groceries. I got, like I showed you guys already, chocolate chips and avocados because avocados, like I was saying, so freaking expensive, but they were um, on sale at a local discounted grocery store. So got some avocados. I think you get four. Actually, I think, do you put avocados in the fridge? I think you do. I don't know. I'm going to put them in the fridge just in case because they are like a fruit item. And then I got McDonald's for my mom because my mom is a very healthy eater. <laughs> but every once in a while she gets Mickey D's. And then I picked up two bags of chocolate chips because at the grocery store, chocolate chips are literally like $4. But at this discounted grocery store I go to, they're only 99 cents. So I got two and I'm going to put them in baking it's like the baking section of my apartment so it was kind of hard to film because the t3i doesn't autofocus so you have to manually focus it and it's kind of hard and i'm like out of breath because i just said mcdonald's my new favorite thing at mcdonald's though by the way so I'm so much for eating healthy but my new favorite thing at mcdonald's is literally one mcchicken a large soda a large fry and a mcdouble Oh my gosh, I haven't ordered a McDouble. I don't even think I've ever ordered a McDouble. But Juan said I did, so apparently I did. But McDouble is so freaking good. It's two patties. They're really thin, so it's like not too bad. And then a bun, cheese, pickles, onions, ketchup. I think mustard, I think. I don't know. So good. I cannot even breathe. So we went for a little bike ride. Actually, we rode our bikes to this grocery store because I had to go to the grocery store again to get more stuff for guacamole because I got the avoc avocados to make guac but we were out of chips and cilantro so I went back to the grocery store but rode my bike so that you know pretty healthy good for me I don't know and it's literally like a windstorm outside it is so windy so my hair looks like I just came out of a hurricane but that's okay let's show you grocery haul part two these chips Delish, the restaurant style tortilla chips. Actually, strips, not chips. Tortilla trip, chip strips. And then some fresh cilantro. Only 50 cents. 50 cents for this entire bundle. So that's what we got. And we're going to make guac, homemade guac. So might do a video, a cooking video on that if you guys want to see a um, how to make homemade guac. It's pretty simple, but it's like the best, right, mom? The best guac. So, comment down below if you guys want to see a 
how to make homemade guac vid. It's super simple, but it's delish. So we like to add a little salsa, or you could always add fresh tomatoes, but we don't have any right now, so we're gonna add some salsa, some garlic salt, and some uh, just a few jalapenos, I'm guessing. Yeah. And of course, the avocados. And garlic and onions. I love onions, so. And garlic. So we'll add that. And that's pretty much it. It's delish. And Missy's gonna chop the garlic for me. Yes, I'm the garlic chopper. Good. Gosh, Missy, no. kind of right. These are one of the, this, these are the this best avocados I've seen in a long time. That's good. I mean, it's rare when you buy a pack like this to not have mm -hmm. like, some that are bruised. And yeah. I even squeeze the top. Like, yes, you have to get every little bit, girl. Avocados are like my favorite fruit. Are they fruit? Yeah. Fruit. The guac is completed. Let's do a taste tester. And my chicken. Ah. Mm-hmm. Perfection. Credit to mother. I love burning candles at night. Go BH Cosmetics. I've been wearing my eyeliner, this thick eyeliner, all day ever since this morning. And it is like now 8 o'clock at night. Yeah. 8? Yeah. 8 o'clock at night. And this thing has barely smudged. So I'm wearing the... the this is the one I do in, use in like all my tutorials. It's the BH Cosmetics uh, liquid liner. It's just a basic black liquid liner. It's like a felt tip. I'm sure you guys have seen me use it. But seriously... For having it all all day and barely smudging, that is pretty good. Love it. I'm having a little midnight snack. My real semi-sweet chocolate chips. They're always tempting to me, tempting to me, tempting me. <laughs> uh, by the way, hold on, let me chill. Tomorrow, I'm going to film my infamous chocolate chip recipe that I showed you guys. Oh. It was a few vlogs ago, and it was titled my um, it was titled "Best Chocolate Chips," "Best Chocolate Chip Cookies." I think I don't know. I'll have that link down below. I actually um, like made them, but I didn't show you guys how. But tomorrow I'm gonna do like a full on video on how to make them and like ingredients. It's so easy, but it's the best recipe that I've found like to date that I really like. So I'll film that tomorrow, and it'll probably be up in a few days. So and I'll put it up on my vlog channel, I think, because it's. It'd be kind of weird if I put it on my main channel, so stay tuned for that. Alright, so it's pretty much dark now, so I guess that's it for today's vlog. I will see you guys very soon in my next vlog. Bye!